Hello, this is PASC PLC. In this short tutorial, I will show you how to write and send the data over Modbus protocol in Codesys environment. Uh, so let's, let's jump to the Modbus slave structure. I have declared here uh, variables, one word variable, mb0. Also, we have a bool variables, mbx0 and, and mbx1. Mm, this variables I will be using for send the real variable of Modbus protocol. Uh, as, a, as a hint, uh, real variable um, consists of four bytes and that's why we have to send this in two words. mbv1 and mbv2, this is one variable for real variable and mbreal var, this is also a word variable and we will use use it also to transfer to send the real variable mm, but uh, we will talk about it later let's jump to the plc prg uh, we have a uh, to assign a value to a variable modbus register it is a very simple we assign the value in this example 3 to mb0 we can also assign a bit var variables. If we declared a um, register mb0 to set a bit, we have to use these functions. So mb0.0 and mb0.1. And then we can assign the values. Uh, another way is to declare a values, bool, vari bool values bool variables sorry and then we assign here a, a true value mm, another way to write a value uh, we can use a direct addressing or direct write to modbus address so we will write to those addresses this is qx 2.2 and qx 2.3 so let's have a look if it is working uh, let's start our PLC. Log in. And we have right here a true statement to those bits and to those addresses. So let's have a look. Okay, so it's it's working. MB0, we have true and true and also mbx0, mbx1, we have true and true, and we have assigned also a true statement for those addresses, so it is working. So let's have a closer look how to send a real variable from Modbus protocol. So in my case, I'm using, um, I'm using a pointers because we have to split the real variable to two words, because real, it it is a uh, um, four bytes and word it's only a two bytes so we have to send this value in two registers so in first case we have to assign the address of our uh, real value um, so it is here we assign it to, we assign it to our pointer then we write to our modbus register and bv1 the first two bytes and then we are incrementing with two our pointer because we have to jump to second two bytes of real value and assign the bytes to a second Modbus register. So the real value will be written here in those two variables. Another one, another way to send a real value, we can assign only one register but it will it is a little bit tricky and then we have to do proper um, settings in our mode bus um, so i will explain it here so we have declared here a address we assigned here address of our uh, real value to the pointer we have also a pointer to our mode bus variable then we assign here our first two bytes to our mode bus um, the register then we jump two bytes uh, forward to get the uh, second two bytes from the real value variable and then we are signing it to to the to the 
uh, to the proper register so we are signing those bytes here but if we run this program let's have a look here what's happened uh, we have here mbv1 and mbv2 this is the same variable as here so we should have the same values and we are seeing here that we have this those values the same but take a look here it is great so in our case that's mean that these values aren't um, transmitted to the modbus uh, modbus protocol we are seeing only changes here in our codices environment and i will show you this that this is the case mm, sorry let's connect it to our modbus slave and let's read the data so the data are changing this sorry this one is here this one is here this one is here and this should be here and we are seeing that the value isn't changing this is because we haven't done proper settings we don't have here any um, any variable declaration so that's why we we doesn't send this uh, these values over modbus protocol um, to do this let's go to the modbus tcp slave structure and we have to change those settings always update variables and we should uh, choose enable one or enable two we can use enable one let's write this to our project let's log in log in your download okay let's start the project so this is not not great uh, great anymore so we should have we should see the values yes we are seeing the values the values are being transmitted or send it through the modbus protocol uh, to see that we are sending the real values I've written also a C sharp program in Visual Studio just to to see if the, the communication is working so I will run this program connect so we are seeing 48 49 so the communication was working and I'm reading the um, Modbus variables in this case I'm reading the real value over Modbus protocol okay so for this moment that's it if you have a questions just write below in comments or if you want to see the C sharp program write also in comments then I will make also a tutorial how to make it thanks for watching and till next time